All right, in today's video, I'm gonna show you how to find top dead center of your engine. This is good to find if you're doing a cylinder leak down One test. gauge I've had in the house for a while. It's a vacuum fuel pump gauge. It goes from a vacuum of 30 to a pressure of 10 PSI, which is more than enough for what we're gonna do it for. And what I did right now is that I connected it to an airline connector. And then with this OTC leakage tester kit, since it has a hose that plugs into the spark plug well and then this end plugs in here well I'm just gonna plug it inside here That's how it's gonna work so if I'm turning over the engine by hand and I'm reading pressure going all the way up then all of a sudden it hits zero and I start reading vacuum I got too far then I just reverse the direction I'm cranking the engine until it hits right around the zero mark and then I'll take me pretty close if not almost all dead on and top dead center. Compression. Oh. It just dropped. So as mentioned before, this will get you close to the top dead center. You'd go into a compression. Hits now I'm reading vacuum. Then you go back. You gotta try to find that magic spot in the middle. right about there but however pull gauge off Yeah, I was dead on. There you have it. Now as far as relying on this to find TDC, you're pretty close, but I would always double check with something in the cylinder that you can manually crank it over just to make sure you're at top dead center. Otherwise, you don't want to have wrong results. But if you do what I say, it's just crank the cylinder over till it sits around the zero mark. If you go too far, start pulling vacuum or compression, depending on what stroke you're on, you should get close or either right on. If you have any questions or comments, post them below. Otherwise, thanks for watching.